Hello once again YouTube and welcome to another video with The Domain. I'm sure you've all checked out part one where I built our Flood Diorama. I added Noble Team fighting two Flood Hunters and then the Master Chief shooting out to space and he's avoiding all these nasty Flood Spores. So today we're going to display like a billion Flood. The only two figures that we've not displayed properly are Noble Six, but this is going to be the Deliver Hope Noble Six. Only Operative Dare because I guess she was on Reach before she went to... New Mombasa, I don't know. We've got so many Flood, I barely know where to begin, but we'll start with this ghost here, okay? This is the Flood-infected ghost. So this will have smashed through all the barricades and it'll be making it into the main compound. The main defense of the compound will be these flame marines. One, two, three. This has the old school flamethrower, but it's still the new articulation. But these three all have the brand new flamethrowers and the cool new backpacks. This is from the Marine Customizer Pack. Really nice set. And this one comes with the active flamethrower. It's gonna be a main line of defense of flame marines trying to destroy any flood that try and break through the main gate. They were holding the line, but then the ghost drove through so fast they had to quickly jump out of the way. This one, he's still holding the line. He's gonna be flaming some flood elites here. My see-through box, I found two flames. And we can attach that to this guy's hand, like the hand is literally on fire from the flame. I think I might decide what UNSC forces I have first. We got Dare and Noble 6, Slack ODST here. Here's our Reach Marine and a Technician and also a Medic. These three are like the infection invasion figures. Missile Pod, always great. Hazard Containment Marines. Couple more Marines and then the rest are all just Flood. And we've also got an Active Camo Carter. Now obviously it won't be Carter in this diorama, it'll just be some other active camo Spartan. My AC weapons box here, he'll be doing some kind of stealth op. And that is all of our UNSC figures. So, like I usually do with dioramas, I like to think about where the UNSC are and then position the enemy around them. We're gonna have someone firing the Mac cannon. We'll have this little Marine here. Pop that open. We'll have Noble Six with his 10th anniversary assault rifle. It'll be like the last mission of Reach. He'll just be trying to survive while the Master Chief is getting to his outpost. Only Operative Dare needs to be getting ready to escape Reach so she can get to Halo 3 ODST on time. We'll stick with Halo Reach weapons, keep it cannon, DMR, for the Scout, grenade launcher for the EVA, and we'll have this painted rocket launcher for the Hazard. These guys will all be defending the line, so let's have the Medic, he's kneeling down and treating the civilian. We'll have the ODST defending the Medic with dual-wheeled SMGs. He's gonna be stopping some flood getting up those stairs. We've actually got two mounted machine gun turrets. One there, one there. In the middle of that, We'll have a missile pod as well. Ah, there's my other flame. I thought I had another flame. He's still firing his flamethrower. He's not taking his hand off the trigger. He's so scared. Give them all matching radio backpacks. One, two, three. And then these two are basic grunts, but this is clearly the commander. So the commander will be on the missile pod and the grunts on the machine gun turret. Because this is the only Halo Reach Marine I actually have, we're gonna put him with Noble Six, just trying to survive. This flood pod has crashed and he's investigating it to make sure more reinforcements don't arrive. He'll have taken out this flood marine that was coming out of the pod. This marine here is gonna be overwhelmed by flood. These two marines are trying to hold on to each other for dear life while flood are carrying both of them away from different angles. <laughs> Ooh, a little evil. Okay, and these three have them holding the line here. Scout here, has up here. He's gonna be overwhelmed too. It may look like a lot of these guys are struggling right now and you're about to see why this is about to get overwhelmed by flood. And I mean overwhelmed. That's the UNSCs displayed, now we're gonna get onto the Flood. Now, the first one I'm gonna include is my favorite, the Halo 4 Flood form. For this guy, we got two simple pieces, a transparent rod, and then also, from this bucket, one of these. I prefer, I don't like the 90 degree angle, this angle's a bit better for what I want. And because it's got holes in it, we can pop the rod inside, like this, and into his back or into his leg is a little bit better. He's jumping in from above, 
and he's about to give them a whole world of problems. Nice, next one. We've got one, two, three more flood hunters. Noble Six on his last stand. We'll have one breaking through this defense here. This guy's just being thrown to the side. Carrier Pod. He's gonna be bumbling into the battle, hoping someone pops him. EVA is gonna have a hard decision because you do not want a grenade launch or one of those things. Coming out to the top of it will be a Flood Spore. We've got an active camo elite Flood. These ones are super rare. Sneaking through to assault that poor Marine. Then we've just got two Marines. These ones will have been recently infected. One of them is being shot at by the ODST's SMG. Then we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight more flood. And they've got to be decorated all over this battlefield. So I always like to think that some of these things happen in waves. So maybe they've already dealt with the first wave of zombies and maybe the second are coming. So we'll pile up a few flood infection forms here. These all came in the first wave. They were quickly disposed of before the second wave arrived. We'll have a team of these blue elites running through here. These orange ones will be trying to take out Noble Six. We'll have a couple that he has already killed lying down, but they just keep on coming. These darker blue ones will have overwhelming this flame marine. We'll just have one screaming on top of this post, one being taken out by this DMR. A few purples here running towards the main fight. Some blue ones here. We'll have this one has already been killed, capturing the green marine, eating the marine as we speak. We've got three more right now and then we'll start repositioning some of these and adding the spores. One running here, one here. Yeah, he's already been killed. That is a lot of flood elites. Now we'll get some spores on. I have one, two, three, four new articulation spores. So these will be in some focal points, the really important ones. We'll have one jumping up here. He's about to attack the commander on top of here in the middle of the noble team fight loads of these little guys. Let's get them off. This may look crowded, but if anybody plays any game with Flood, you know, these spores just get everywhere. Bish bash bosh. That is all of the flood spores. Goodness me. I'll give it a couple of tweaks and then we'll conclude this epic diorama. And just like that, a couple of hours later, we've done all the touch-ups we need. This is absolutely perfect. I could not be happier with this diorama. And last request from Zealot Pilots, or Zealot Pellets, I don't know how you pronounce it. That guy on YouTube requested I included Avery, which really you can't have an SS Motion domain diorama without him. So I'm just gonna pop him here. Wow, that is the complete Halo Reach flood mock diorama. Thank you very much for tuning in. Thank you just for your overwhelming support of almost everything I do at the minute. Your support of my eBay listings to help me financially is amazing. And just the view subscribers, they keep on going through the roof. Thank you for everything, and I'll see you next time. A little baby flood spore. What, what could this little thing do? What, what damage could it? A single flood spore can destroy an entire species. <laughs>
Single Flitzboy signing out.